Hey guys, thought I would just show you something interesting that I found. Um, I was messing around with uh, the piston T flip flops where um, if you hook up a monostable circuit to uh, a piston, some of you may know that uh, it'll leave the block behind when it uh, push a sticky piston pushes out the uh, block and then it'll pull it back again when another pulse is sent. But um, I thought it'd be interesting to see what would happen if uh, I hooked up two sticky pistons both to the same pulser and um, had them both try and uh, grab a block. So basically it, re it repeats uh, a pattern. So basically if you start it in the middle it's going to get pulled to the um, left one and then it's going to get shoved over to the right and then put back in the middle. And it uh, repeats this process as many times as it goes. Which I think is a little weird but it does nonetheless. Now um, I'd say that the north-south rule does not apply to this as I have four of them set up all different directions and um, they all work exactly the same which I can't say as much for another test I ran where I had four pistons all trying to grab the same block oh, it's a good weather. now uh, this is pretty random but it's interesting nonetheless it sets up a um, an, a pattern uh, oop, and it repeats that pattern over and over again but the uh, what pattern you get you'll get is random. It's kind of weird. So like it'll go to the top, bottom. Uh, oops. Sometimes it doesn't switch right and then left, and it repeats this pattern as many times as you want. But uh, if you try and build it somewhere else, it might not have the same pattern, which is a little weird. But um, yeah. So uh, yeah, I don't know if anyone's uh, come out with this before. I mean, this uh, way of the block swapping or a three input, I guess. Um, if they have, let me know. If not, hey, kudos to me, but whatever. <laughs> so yeah, uh, just thought I'd show you guys that. So, yeah. see you guys later.